Today I'm going to be testing Cartex compound against the new 2023 AutoSmart Evo X compound. This test isn't sponsored in any way. We used Cartex ourselves in our shop and Paul from AutoSmart came in a few days ago and said we have a new formula compound. Let me know what you think. And I thought here is an opportunity for our first proper video. So we're using the supplied buffing pads from each specific brand for the compound and we'll be using the Diamond Cut 3000 from Cartec followed by the Final Cut 9000 and from the Art Smart range we'll be using the Evo X Heavy Cut followed by the Evo X Ultra Fine Finish. Cartec have more in the range but the Evo X is now only a two stage so I've chosen the closest two from the Cartec for comparison. Trying to keep the passes the same to keep the test as fair as possible and I'll be speeding up some of the video so I don't bore you all to death. The results are interesting and I'll show some still images at the end which will give a clear winner in my eyes but let's see your comments below. The clear coat that we used on this mini roof was Spectral Clar 545 which is a low bake 40 degree for 15 minutes um, which we started using around a year ago um, it's been around four days since the roof was painted and it was denibbed with our Kovax denib kit and then we run a 3M2000 soft pad dry over the whole roof to give a nice uniform finish to polish up So we've done as, as close as we can to the same number of passes with both initial compounds, Cartex Diamond Cut 3000 and the Evo X Heavy Cut. And now I'm switching to the Final Cut 9000 from Cartex and the Evo X Ultra Fine Finish. The both finishing compounds, some people refer to them as swirl removers. And at this point, I'm noticing the Cartex slightly ahead. We're now switching to the white compound um, pads to keep it as fair as possible. They're both specific to each compound brand. Now when filming this video, I made a rookie error and left the DJI Action Camera 3 in the protective dive cover I use when filming painting to keep overspray off it and it overheated from being in the case so I didn't get the footage of the second passes with the finishing compound but both sides had two applications with the same passes 
and were cleaned with panel wipe afterwards just to make sure neither brand were using fillers to give a false initial finish that would drop over time and after washing. Now results time. Both look similar until you use the colour match light. And then it's apparent that the car tech has done a lot better job. The AutoSmart's nicer to use in a way it's smoother and kind of glides better when polishing. But it just doesn't perform as well as the car tech on a side by side test. With the Evo X you can see there's quite a lot of circular swirl marks from the buffing. Um, they show up really badly in the light. When you switch to the Kartec, way better.